People often ask me, how can I bring up oral sex in my relationship? You know, lots of couples who are in their 40s or 50s or 60s or beyond grew up in a generation where oral sex, that is a man or a woman's placing their mouth on the genitals of their partner, was just not something that was considered to be a legitimate part of sex life and sex play. That's different for the younger generation. Oral sex is very commonly done done among couples who are in their 20s and 30s. So those of us who are a little older sometimes feel a bit squeamish about oral sex. And I just want to say to people, you ought to talk about it if that's something you're interested in, just like you ought to talk about anything that you might be interested in doing with your partner. And if there's an opportunity to try things that you haven't tried before, oral sex is a great example of something that people might want to try. I find almost no couples who try oral sex to say, I didn't like it or it wasn't gratifying for me. And it's a wonderful way for people to expand their sexual repertoire. Oral sex can be a wonderfully erotic experience for both men and women. And I, and I think that most everyone who tries it says, gee, I've been missing a lot over all these years. I'm glad I know this now. This is going to be a part of what I do in the future.